Okay, when you get the boat back into the uh, the boat shed, and you could either do that by, it's a little easier, especially in the wind, to dock on the dock, and then using the uh, dock lines, and ideally help with, from someone else, move the boat around the corner into the shed, or just drive it right into the shed. But again, if there's wind, you have to kind of compensate for it, and it can be a little tricky. Uh, getting it into the shed. But this is what you hold on to to position the boat uh, to start the lift. Um, you want it centered, uh, at, not surprisingly, centered in the boathouse. You also want to have, I'll put a piece of tape, actually this cleat here, that cleat can be uh, about even with this post. And, and remember got, that you were putting it too far forward and then that was affecting the... Yeah, it could be just behind the post, um, kind of kind of back. The cleat is here. Right around there, right, Maybe, like right yeah, behind the yeah. post. Okay, so now I'm going to turn on the valve and it'll very quickly start to, to raise the boat up. Okay, now you can look at the valves here. Oh, and Ollie's on the boat. Oh, and well, then we can't lift it. <laughs> 